Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, you're welcome. In today's video, I'm going to be telling you what you should know before sewing your wedding dress or before considering you know to sew your wedding dress because from the moment i started posting videos on the things i'm making for my wedding or things i have made for my wedding i began to get a lot of questions on okay what how much should i charge for a wedding dress i'm a beginner should i sew my wedding dress should i not sew my wedding dress i got a ton of questions and i just said to use this video to address everything because, because i don't want you starting something that you cannot finish so one of the main reasons i've, I've been contemplating the idea of doing this video okay but one of the main reasons that pushed me one of the main things that pushed me was when I got this comment on one of my videos and I'm going to read it out to you. She said, I'm a beginner, will I be able to make mine following this tutorial? And she dropped this question on the video I made about how I cut my wedding dress. And when I saw this question, I, I just told myself that I won't keep pushing this video forward. I'm just going to let you guys know, okay, this is what you need to know before you just wake up from your sleep and say you want to make a wedding dress. Now, the first thing you should know is how good are your sewing skills? You guys, I'm always starting. I'm always starting. You know, when uh, this kind of conversations with how good are your sewing skills because you need to know how good you are before you even think of sewing a wedding dress. A wedding dress is like advanced sewing. It is advanced sewing, and even me that I said to make mine, I think I've watched them sew a wedding dress about four times. I don't think it's up to four, maybe about three times. So I really had to like sit down and ask myself very well, like, okay. And that you really want to do this and if you want to sew your wedding dress something you should put into consideration is how much can you draft basics like basic skirt basic blouses basic necklines basic bustiers how can you manipulate the bustiers even if it's like a, a basic bustier how can you manipulate it into like a a, a princess that bustier an off shoulder bustier these basic sewing skills how you're finishing where you're putting your forcible interface how good are they because when it comes to a wedding dress a lot of things is involved and if you don't know how to sew very well you are just going to mess it up and i'm sure nobody wants to mess her wedding dress up so one thing you should ask yourself is how good are my sewing skills genuinely tell yourself how good your sewing skills are don't just be like oh i can sew i can sew i can sew my dear it's not going to help you lie to yourself so just ask yourself how good are my sewing skills how have i been able to come back this time this time this time and this time you know how am i finishing because one thing about a wedding dress is that like, only if you are going to a very exotic wedding dress but most times wedding dresses go from really simple to classy and any little mistake i don't know whether it's because it's just white any little mistake is just going to show up everywhere around the dress so one question i always ask people is how good are your sewing skills most of, most of you that have chatted me online, the first question I ask is how good are your sewing skills? Can you sew a very beautiful gown seamlessly without any guide, without any you know, mistake? No, there are always mistakes, but without you always running every two, two minutes to another person for help, you know, without you getting stuck and not knowing what to do. Because one thing about wedding dresses, you have to understand the process from number one to number 20 before you even decide to make a wedding dress, okay? Now, now another thing you should know before you consider making your wedding dress is how long have you been sewing okay how long have you been sewing because i won't advise anybody who has just been three months into sewing to make their wedding dress and i know a lot of people will disagree with me be like oh i went for sewing class learned everything within three months but the question i always ask you is in your mind of mind your mind of mind 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 do you think you can really give a good job because a wedding dress is a combination of both you know sewing techniques sewing tricks and what you've learned over time because you meet some things that you have never learned before and maybe because you've learned for a while and you've been practicing that way you'll be able to combat you know the challenges that comes with making a wedding dress so one thing i always tell people is you know how long have you been sewing for where you were sewing did you watch them sew any wedding dress have you attempted sewing a bridal dress because if you've never made a maybe a cheap breast made gown i always ask people have you been where they made a bridal gown have you been anywhere where a bridal gown has been made and you can attest to yourself you can attest to your capabilities that okay to the best of my knowledge i can sew a bridal gown because if you can sew a very simple bridal gown like for cheap breast made, for the bridal train you are one step to sewing a wedding gown because it is gradually 
okay before i even woke up and said oh i'm going to make my wedding dress it's because i've made several bridal gowns and they turned out nice and people loved it and i'm like okay i think i can make my wedding dress like i said have you been anywhere where they made a wedding dress before do you know the tips the tricks on how to if it's a ball gown how to build the ball gown how to turn over the hem how to build the cup how to pack the cup do you know these tips do you know these tricks do you know basic finishing for wedding gowns do you know how to finish a neckline do you know how to design a wedding gown even if it's just plain do you know how to work a wedding gown for being very simple to very classy do you know all those things if you don't know all these things these are things you have to consider these are things you have to learn before you even consider making a wedding dress if not the wedding dress will come out really ugly and it's not something you like now i always tell people that when it comes to wedding dresses a lot of things you know come into action a lot of things come into play like the fabric the finishing the sewing the technique of the tailor and different things they all come together to make the wedding gown really beautiful really nice and really lovely now one thing you must always put into consideration is the combination of all these your sewing skills how long you've been sewing and if you've actually watched them make a wedding dress see don't think of making a wedding gown if you've not watched someone make a wedding dress from start to finish i know there are lots of wedding gowns okay how to make a wedding gown online but i would really advise you watch how to make a wedding gown maybe in a physical shop or a very detailed online tutorial or online class because that way you get the nitty gritty of everything needed and important to make a wedding dress now something i always advise everybody is if you want to make a wedding gown Okay? Now one thing I always tell people to put in good consideration when they want to make a wedding dress is the fabric. There are different fabrics in the market depending on what you want to sew. So something you should always have at the back of your mind is okay, this is the style I want to make, this is the style I want to make. Then the next thing you should think about is okay, which texture of fabric go with this style. These are things you need to know, these are things you need to know. maybe sometimes go to the market, do a market survey, come back to your house, reanalyze your style before you go ahead to buy and to cut because you might go to the market, buy a very soft fabric, by the time you get to your house and cut the wedding dress, it's not just looking fine, okay? So something you must know or something you should put in consideration before you think of sewing your wedding dress is the fabric. Something I advise, one thing I advise every single person, okay, from experience. From experience guys something I always advise every single person is if to an extent your sewing skills are 7 over 10 which is very good or let's say your sewing skill is 5 over 10 which is like an average and you have this idea of making a wedding dress and you really want to go for it because if you guys watched my previous video I told you guys that if you it's something you want to do and you're convinced you can do it don't let anybody stop you from doing it okay so if you're really convinced that you want to make a wedding dress something you should do is buy a fabric that is not like the fabric you want to use to make the wedding dress but make sure that it's almost the same texture so you won't have issues with texture and style okay buy the fabric cut the side sew it well okay sew it to the best of your abilities if so cut the exact style you want to make for the wedding dress use a fabric that is very if it's even if it's like a, a same fabric but different color like it's not white but make sure the texture is the same texture that you're going to use for the wedding dress because it comes to play into like how the style will look okay so buy the fabric cut the dress after cutting the dress sew the dress if it comes out really fine and really beautiful then you are good to sew your wedding dress but if it doesn't come out fine and you saw some mistakes here there and there you know that okay when i'm sewing my wedding dress i have to look out for this don't just jump all into making a wedding dress wasting the fabric and you become frustrated because it did not come out well so these are things you need to know these are things you need to put into consideration these are things you have to think about and practice before you think of sewing the wedding gown i hope with this few months of mine i've been able to <laughs> I've been able to conf what is the word? I've been able to convince you, okay, of the things you need to know before you say wedding dress. You have something like classroom teacher. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, definitely, definitely give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that whenever I post a video, you get notified. I want to get to 200,000 subscribers this year. I 
and I really need you guys to be part of my journey. So please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that whenever I post a video, you will get notified. Till next time, guys. Thanks for sticking with me. Bye.